afternoon, guys. We are heading to Angleton to pick up a Chevy Silverado that's uh, got a wheel broken off, as uh, the customers explain. I don't know if it's like a ball joint failure or like a wheel bearing or what exactly. They said the, the wheel and tire was coming off though, so we, uh, I don't know if you can see around me here, it's it's about uh, five o'clock right now, so we got work traffic starting to pick up, so we're gonna be on the side of the road and there's probably gonna be a lot of traffic, so we're gonna have to be careful with that, so we, uh, we'll see what we got when we get there. Thanks for watching, guys. shaft or something coming loose. As you can see they have shoulder work going on here. I was asking how you was doing, but I guess it'd be better if your wheel was on, huh? Yeah, I've had uh, I've had them come off before. One of my old Jeeps it wasn't fun. At least you were able to get it off the road without tearing it up. So uh, let me uh, drop my bed real quick. I'll get it hooked up, and then uh, I can jack it up. I got some special blocks. I'll put under it. That way we ain't got to tear up your axle none. Almost, right there, huh? Yeah. That sucks. Yes. Yeah, try to get on this side there. That's one thing I was kind of noticing. 
twist it off or something. It's crazy. Yeah. I don't know. That's, that's the first thing I was, like. The tire never came out from the truck or nothing. Well, and that's why I was wondering if it when it uh, if it even came off or anything. It came off the lugs, but the, right. I guess I just rode it in on the tire. Uh, I lost all brakes and everything. That's so. I guess when the rotor hit the ground. Yeah. Sorry, you want me to throw the tire in the back or what? Uh, yeah, because it's gonna. I'm gonna put this block under it. It'll just slide right up. So. Yeah, it's pouring uh, brake fluid out of it right now. Or right, maybe that's gear oil. No, it doesn't look bad at all. Let me, uh, yeah. Squeeze by it here. Yeah, that's probably about the the worst of it there. Tear up the wheel. That's probably not tear up the engine or anything. Yeah, no, I mean it, everything came out looking pretty good. The rotor don't look nothing. No. Boy, this this fresh asphalt saved it too. Yeah, that's Another one of them saving graces. Let's get blocked up before I drop the tailgate. All right. All right. Let me uh, set her down here real quick. That's what I was kind of looking at. It look you like might. It. Well, put it on the top. Yeah. I mean, if nothing else, clean up the back side of it. I mean, there's there's places that have, I've seen repaired wheels look worse than that. So. Uh, I don't know. Just look for a Nick's rims are a dime a dozen. Well, that's about the good thing. At least it's not like a fancy, expensive wheel, you know. <laughs> the uh, keys in it, or you got the keys? Yeah, or? Got the key. yeah, throw her in neutral, grab my remote. Sure, winch is engaged. under this thing that man blocks the tires I'm gonna what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna walk my truck under it so I don't have to drag it off my uh, blocks until I'm ready so if y'all would, just kind of don't stand behind it.
Yeah. Or else it doesn't help because that one wheel is uh that one wheel is off. It doesn't technically know that it's in park, so. Cause you know it's open open differential, so they're gonna do that number. Set it. Parking brake. That's one of the fun little tricks you can you can do. Right, yeah. Makes it a lot easier. I can, you know. Well, and that's unfortunately that's a lot of it. You know, people are just like, ah, you know, it's messed up already. I'll just drag it, which I could. With that block under it, it probably wouldn't hurt. You know. But go and catch some unlevel ground or something, you know, and tilts off the jack, you know, and. I'm gonna go ahead and suck it on up. Okay, throw her into uh, neutral now. Release the parking brake. It kind of does look a little, but it could also, that angle is also because of the, how the axle's sitting. It'll, yeah, it's just because it's, it's just because that axle's down on that side. Yeah, roll my jack past you here real quick.
get her strapped down. What's that? No, I mean, all the expensive stuff don't look too bad. No, no, I mean, it's... Don't even look like I hardly got a drag mark on it, nothing. As soon as I felt it come off, I hit the shoulder. Hit it. I got no brakes, I didn't know I stopped really. I don't even know how Whenever, whenever it comes off like that, it... They generally uh, don't work too well. That's how it was whenever I lost a wheel on one of my Jeeps. Uh, had a uh, wheel bearing separate on me. And uh, that's how it was. It came off and there was no brakes. That was a nice Jeep. Which one? Just looking at your YouTube page. Oh yeah? Yeah, I know that that white the gladiator, that's yeah, that was mine. having a wheel one wheel on it there it doesn't it's gonna act like it's in neutral I don't want this thing moving around on the deck Up your lug nuts. Where where'd you have it parked at last? I mean, I'm assuming you just got off work, you know. It's possible because especially this body style of Chevy, fairly uh, yeah. fairly regularly stolen. I, I've towed several of them where they take off them factory GM wheels and uh, try to steal the trucks, you know. So I mean, it's, I wouldn't. I would I wouldn't rule it out. I, I wouldn't rule it out. No telling. No telling. That's some weird. Yeah. Alright, I guess you gonna follow us. Yeah, I'll follow I'll follow you over there. Hey like we got very far to go, right? <laughs> Alright. We are loaded up here. Customer lives right here in the area, so almost made it home. So we are going to uh, follow him over to his place, get this thing unloaded. We're gonna is hey, is there any particular side of the driveway you want it on, or just just middle? I. Basketball goal 
they got going there. I mean, as long as they, as long as they hold, you know, I mean, I mean, they don't look all bent up or nothing. They don't, That's, don't nothing look bad. Understand it. It's like somebody loosened look, up your lug nut. Like That's crazy. Or somebody's trying to get me murked. Right? <laughs> uh, I guess that's, that's one way of making it look like an accident, right? thing wants to slide off all the way. That way your hitch don't drag. Yeah. 
Yeah, no, you're gonna need some more of that. Pull my bed forward a little bit here. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, it's holding a little more weight than normal. Look at right about there. Is that too close to your garage or oh, so I can I can still adjust it a little bit. Alright. I guess the good thing is it didn't mess too much up. Slap the wheel back on it, you won't even know what happened. Yeah. So apparently it don't look too bad. No, it doesn't. It doesn't at all. Place them lugs and you'll be good to go. Definitely not as bad as it could have been. Yep. Yeah, I'd take one of these over one of the new ones any day. It's my dad's truck, really. Oh, yeah? Yeah, he's in the hospital. So oh, no. Well, I guess it's probably better it happened to you than him, huh? Yeah. I, I don't even want to call a tail up there. <laughs> he's having a bad enough time in the year. Right. Uh, you got a block or a jack or something you want to stick under that so i gotta get my my block out from under it i got my jack right here but if you got like a jack stand or it's like a block or something to set under it center block? like yeah center block just whatever you want to keep it up off the ground Already be jacked up for you when you get your lugs. <laughs> sure, thank you. No problem. This way. You get which way to pull. I would. I mean, the load bearing way would be up like that, yeah. And then low point there would be probably that shock hanger. You go back just a little bit more. It shouldn't. This one corner don't weigh hardly nothing. Now, if you was you know trying to balance the whole truck on it, last panel is given. That's crazy. I about the only way that that would have happened without causing too much damage is the lugs came loose. That's about it. Alright. I'm gonna get my stuff put up here. Get uh, settled up with the customer. Be ready for whatever comes next. Thanks for watching guys. <laughs>